All right, Shalom. Before I get started with this lesson, I want to give all praises, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Racha Kodash. Double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone and Shalom to all the Akim in his truth and sincerity. And I just want to do this, uh, Lord willing, it be a quick uh, lesson. All right, going into how it's too late, E. All right, it's way too late, E. All right, when I say E, I'm speaking about Esau, okay? Esau, the Edomites, okay, you so-called white people, because you so-called white people, you're not white, all right, you're, you're biblical nationality, because every, every nation, every race of people, or nation, because when you look up the word nation, it goes back to race of people, all right, they try to change the, the, the meaning of that word, nation, but every race of people on the face of the earth right now has a biblical na uh, nationality, all right, a biblical heritage, all right, and a biblical heritage uh, slash nationality of you so-called white people are the Edomites, okay? And it's too late for you, all right? You, you, you try to, uh, you, you're still trying to uh, push that played out, wacky tacky religion known as uh, Christianity. It's too late, all right? That, that shit's played out, all right? And I'm just, uh, I was inspired because I was watching uh, Elder y Yashawamba, and uh, he was pretty much doing this video on this uh, wacky tacky Christian Okay, there was uh, pretty much trying trying to uh, denounce the truth. Okay, all right, calling himself uh, exposing uh, all these different celebrities, and then he brought up uh, Kendrick Lamar, saying that because uh, that uh, Kendrick Lamar in his song he said, uh, "Don't call me black no more, I'm an Israelite." He was trying to um, you know trying to denounce the truth. You know, like like wacky techy Christians such as uh, Vocab. All right, but it's too late, you saw. All right. You're not going to stop the 144,000 in the elect from being sealed. You, you can't do it. You can't denounce the truth. And I'm going to uh, start off in Acts chapter 5. Um, let me see here. Let me see here. Uh, what verse am I going to start at? I'm really just going to stay in this chapter. I might, I might uh, get some more precepts. Uh, Acts chapter 5 and verse... I'll start at 27. It says, And they, and when they had brought them, they set them before the council, and the high priest asked them, saying, Did not we straightly command you that ye should not teach in this name? So they were bringing the apostles, all right? Uh, they brought the, the apostles into a council, all right, the, the high priest, okay? Those, those wicked, uh, those wicked high priests, those wicked uh, Pharisees, which those those same wicked niggas that they're back in the reincarnation, okay? Those same niggas that don't <laughs> don't don't think for a second that, that those guys aren't back. They're back, okay? Especially we're in the last days. That those same niggas are back, all right, to receive their judgment, as it, as it is written in the uh, book of um in the book of Ecclesiastes, the first chapter. There's no new thing under the sun. So those same wicked niggas are back today, and the same uh, righteous apostles and those same righteous prophets of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, they're back today. Lord willing, I'm a part of that. Okay, Lord willing, you sincere uh, listeners of this video are a part of that. But uh, verse 28 it says, did, saying, "Did we not straightly command you that ye should not teach in this name? And behold, ye have filled Jerusalem with your doctrine, and intend to bring this man's blood upon us." All right. Because the, the, the blood of Yahweh Shai was upon those, those wicked niggas, all right? Because they're, they're the ones who had him put to death, all right? They said crucify him. So those, those niggas, they knew they were guilty, all right? They were try, trying to run, run from that. They were trying to uh, stop the, the name of Yahweh Shai from being exalted, which you can't do it, all right? You can't do that, all right? Trying to denounce the truth is like, that's like trying to stop the sun from, 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 being, from rising every day. Like, you can't do it. You can't fly up to the sun and pull the sun down. No, the sun is going to be up there, all right? The same way with this truth. You can't pull this truth down. You can't stop it, all right? Just like you can't stop the, the, you can't stop the sky from being blue, all right? You, you can't change the, the, the color of the sky to, to being green, all right? You can't do it, all right? You wacky, tacky Christians, all right? You, you, you wacky, demonic Edomites. You're not going to stop it, all right? Your judgment is coming, all right? America is going to be destroyed by thermonuclear missiles, according to uh, Malachi, the fourth chapter, according to uh, Revelation uh, 
the ninth chapter, all right, where it speaks about 200,000, thousand, those are the missiles. So America's going to be destroyed, and the nation of Edom, you're going into slavery, okay, under the Israelites. And we're not black, okay, we're not black Hebrew Israelites, we're Israelites.